The under 18s Matty Davis Cup final seen Bloomfield face Cornmoney FDC on a wet and windy evening at Seaview. Bloomfield had the game's first attack. Aaron Hawthorne can advance, but it was Adam McCulloch who had his goal bound shot blocked as it went out for a corner. Both teams contested in the middle of the pitch in their attempts to get the ball under control in tough conditions. It was Carmoney he came out with possession as Nathan Johnston played this ball over the top for Aidan Gillen to chase. He let it bounce once before unleashing a fantastic strike that beat Cameron Livingston in goal. The Bloomfield keeper was called into action once again shortly after. They gave the ball away cheaply here in midfield. Goal scorer Gillen drove at the defence and had a go. Livingston tipping it round the post. Into the second half and despite it being evening for the opening 10 minutes, Corn Money countered here. Gillen involved once again down the left hand side. He crossed for Harry Morrow to top home making it 2. Bloomfield had a great chance to reduce the scores. The ball fell kindly here for Tongai Watson, but he couldn't quite get his effort on target. Whilst down at the other end, Gillen quickly dispatched this ball forward to Morrow to chase. He made his way goalwards to slot it under the oncoming keeper, making it 3-0. Corn Money were very much enjoying the game despite the horrible weather. Nathan Johnston adding his name to the score sheet with the strilled effort into the bottom corner. Bloodfield did, however, have chances. This driven free kick by Jack Mackay was tipped over the bar by the keeper. And from the resulting corner, Bloomfield scored what resulted in a consolation goal as Aaron Hawthorne directed his header home at the back post. The referee brought an end to the final. Deserved winners in the end as Cornmoney FDC beat Bloomfield by four goals to one.